What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Talking Wrestling TV, and with the Monday Night Raw review after Elimination Chamber. Another horrible damn show, WWE. Horrible show. Booked in a city where the crowd was complete silent all night. The crowd was just probably the worst in Monday Night Raw history. And then, guys, you wait until the night after Elimination Chamber, a fucking C level pay per view, to bring out four of the best that NXT has to offer. This is what we're doing now, WWE. Asher Black and Ricochet and DIY coming out to complete library silence. I just don't understand, WWE. We're 49 days away from WrestleMania. We got no bill leading to WrestleMania. We're three weeks away from Fast Lane. <laughs> we get no bill. This is like WWE, y'all writing the shows right out the fly. There's nobody even writing the shows. I don't understand what WWE is doing. Why bring up four of the best that NXT has to offer in a damn city that doesn't even know who they are? I just don't understand. I know the AEW effect is real, guys. But this was a horrible damn show. Tonight, Monday Night Raw was horrible. It was trash. I'm not even going to go over anything on the show. I'm so pissed off what WWE done. We're bringing up these guys from NXT. And, and then they let us know with notification. Two hours before the show kicks off. I just don't get it. Guys, I just hope we get a great SmackDown Live. and I'll just be in with the SmackDown Live review. Sometime after the show goes off, it's just been horrible trying to watch Monday Night Raw tonight with the NXT guys coming up to complete library silence. I just don't get it, guys. This your boy, Talking Wrestling TV. Leave a like, comment, subscribe. I'm out.